Hey guys, welcome to another video. Um, today I'm going to be doing another install. Um, it's going to be a little bit more challenging. Just to recap, I actually have only done a few cosmetic mods. Let me just give you a walk around of the car so you guys can see what I've already done. And then I'll let you know what I'm doing next. So if you guys remember, I did go ahead and install my lip um, a couple months ago. Also my bezels. So I did wrap my roof. That was my other video. I also did get the Subi Speed tail lights. I also have a video on that. Along with the fourth brake light down here. Um, that's basically all the mods that I've done to my car as of now. I have decided to install an exhaust and it's gonna be the awe the track edition um it is a little bit louder than the touring edition because they have two um but i have heard that track edition and it sounds really good so i went with that one we'll see how it sounds on mine i'm gonna go ahead and start unboxing um the exhaust i did purchase it through subi speed i'll put the link in the description box below i will include some sound clips at the very end so if you guys want to see that um you guys can keep on watching but yeah i hope you enjoy the video and if you haven't done so please like and subscribe all right guys so this is my exhaust um as you can see it's awe it's upside down but yeah let me get started i'm gonna go ahead and pull it open Okay, so when you open it, this is what it looks like. In here, I haven't, um, I haven't opened it yet. So I went with the black tips. You can either do black or chrome. I think black looks awesome. Here's a little guide, which I might need to see just in case I get stuck. But yeah, these are the tips. I think the black is gonna look so sick. Let me keep on unboxing and then I'll show you guys the rest. Okay, so basically this is the exhaust. This is a layout. Um, obviously the mid pipe doesn't fit because um, of the box, but yeah, this is basically how it's gonna go. Um, these are the axle backs, which are the ones that you can actually replace if you want it to be a little bit more quiet to the ones that have the mufflers. Um, but I ended up going with this one since it's a little bit louder. Um, I'll see how it sounds. Obviously if it's too loud for me, I'll consider getting the other axle back, but uh, we'll see. Also, um, this is a mid pipe. Um, it does have a resonator, um, but other than that, the rest of the exhaust is basically just three inch pipe. I believe it's three inches. So I'm taking off the um, axle back bolts. There's um, four of them in total back here. Um, they are 14 millimeter. So there are two um, hangers on each side of the axle. So there's four in total. And I saw one back there. So I think there's five um, confirmed. And yeah, and then there's actually only two more bolts back there. Okay, so now that we took off the bolts, I'm gonna go ahead and take off the hangers. Um, it might be a little complicated, so I'm gonna try my best. I don't have that tool that you need in order to do it, but um, I'm gonna use these, these clamps. Hopefully they can help me. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna just tug on this really quick. Do the hangers you're trying to remove. Um, I'm using these clamps and then basically just holding the top and the rubber and then just pulling it. So I've been doing that. Um, I'm also gonna use a flathead to try to pull it out. Okay, so I got the first one out. Um, for the second one, there's actually a little trick. Um, you can actually just pull it since it's going out that way. Um, so I'm gonna set up the camera so you guys can see. Um, but yeah, this clamp is super helpful if you have one of these, super handy. Just, um, it helps you push it through at the end. I just kind of got up and I pulled it because I just needed like a little bit of go. But yeah. So the second hanger is actually up there. But after you release the first hanger, um, you can actually just tug this one out. Oh. 
Okay, so now that the axle backs are out, I'm gonna go ahead and um, take off this um, hanger and then the two bolts that are over there in the middle uh, somewhere. Choose your fighter. guys so i finished finally these are the tips i think it looks so good it doesn't stick out that much um and i think it looks so good because it's black um i'm gonna go ahead and turn it on just to make sure i don't have any exhaust leaks but this is the outcome let me go ahead and turn it on so you guys can hear it Ooh! and now for some revs Just kidding. <laughs> it's my sister's Jeep. <laughs> Shout out to her. <laughs> Your car sounds so stock. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay, anyways, um, I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on now for real this time. guys so the exhaust is finished i'm a little tired it is super hot um but yeah um everything's already tightened um so should be good to go we did check for some exhaust leaks there were some we uh, tightened it a little bit more so everything's fine um i'm gonna go ahead and do some sound clips so you guys can hear Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the sound clips that I included and I hope you enjoyed the video overall if you made it to this part of my video I just want to say thank you for pulling through um, I really appreciate all the support that I've been receiving um, thank you for all the views and likes and comments I really appreciate it thank you so much for watching also don't forget to follow me on Instagram at STI Liz and if it's your first time watching one of my videos I hope you enjoyed it um, go check out my other videos and give me a subscribe and a like um thank you guys so much once again um i'll see you in the next video Bye. Bye.